Hello everyone. As part of the Amazon Bedrock Agent Core video series, we are going to cover Agent Core identity as part of this video. In the last video, we saw the Agent Core runtime example. We will extend the same example and try to implement authentication on top. So in this example, before calling the agent, it checks the identity against the identity provider. In this case, the identity provider is Amazon Cognito. Bedrock Agent Core can also integrate with Okta and Microsoft Entra ID as identity providers. With this, we'll go into the code walkthrough on the demo. First, we are executing a shell script called Setup Cognito User Pool. So this is a shell script. This shell script automates the complete setup of Amazon Cognito authentication for agent core runtime by creating a user pool, app client, and the test user. It then authenticates the test user and outputs the three key values needed for OAuth configuration the discovery URL, the client ID, and the access token. This is the same as discussed in the previous video explaining how to set up an agent core runtime. Please watch that video for detailed explanation. First, we are preparing the agent for the deployment. Then we set up the agent name and the IAM role. Then we call the configure method from the agent core runtime by passing the necessary parameters here. The entry point, the role, all the libraries that are required to be installed in the Docker image, the region, and the agent name. If you see the main difference here, we are also passing the details for the OAuth authentication. This configuration enables inbound authentications so that only users with the valid Cognito tokens can invoke the agent. The discovery URL tells the agent core where to validate the tokens and allow clients restricts which Cognito app clients are permitted to access this agent. So overall, the configure method creates the necessary Docker file. Finally, we call the launch method from the agent core runtime. The launch method will create the Amazon ECR repository and the agent core runtime. Here we are checking the status of the runtime. The status is ready. Then we go into the Amazon Bedrock Agent Core in the console. So we see the runtime running here. Using the invoke method from the Agent Core runtime, you can invoke the agent by passing the prompt. Since we are not passing the Cognito authentication details, the call got failed with an access denied error. When you call the same invoke method with proper Cognito token, the agent gets successfully invoked and you got the response back. That's the end of this code walkthrough for agent core identity. Thanks.